I'm Eric Kosharski, and this is a really rad weekend. Greetings everybody, I'm Aaron Kosharski. Um, I'm in Fort Walton Beach, Florida. This is a rad junk, the store. And guess what? We're going to a con this weekend, so I'll see you guys in a second. Woo. Well, it would help if I open the lens. Um, so yeah, I just went into that store over there. Um, pretty nice store, pretty cool store. Um, we're gonna go ahead over to get some food. Anyway, I'll see you guys later um, on this adventure. This out of nowhere adventure. So I'm here at Fort Walton Beach. Um, this is the first ever time that I've been to a convention that is on the beach. Not like on the beach, it's on the convention center up the street, but still. It was a pretty far drive, it was like a seven hour drive. It's about half as far as I go to the other cons in, in Texas. But uh, I'm gonna be documenting this whole thing, so. Well, I'm gonna see you guys later because uh, I'm gonna go take a walk on a beach. So I stuck my feet in the waters over here. I don't wanna go too far off my camcorder because if I get it wet, obviously it's gonna you know, fry out. But um, yeah, look at this. Uh, that is definitely water. I'm gonna go head back up north now because. Not north, but uh, up on the beach because my feet are getting wet and cold, and it's really cold out. And we just had a hurricane hit, so the cold wind is uh, blowing down here. I'll see you guys in a second. Whoa. Way over there is a boat. What? what? What better way to spend your time than uh, walking on the beach? Woo. I am leaving the beach. Uh, this will conclude the beach portion of, of this trip. I don't know what's gonna go on for the remainder of the vacation or whatever you wanna call it, but I'll see you in a second. Whoa. Good morning, Vietnam. I am up, it's Friday morning. I got a bunch of stuff I gotta do today in preparation for this little mini con I am doing. Uh, I'm not. Anyway, I'll see you guys later today because uh, I got stuff I gotta go do right now. Uh, in another video that you'll see shortly. So anyway, I will see you guys soon. Whoa. This is the pool at the hotel that we're staying at. Look at how cool this thing is. Big waterfall. Oh, but it's cold out. It is freezing. So yeah, there's my backyard right now at the hotel. We got cups. This is a little overview of the layout of the con. There's a ton of people here in one small little room. And look, there's Aaron's tapish. And a bunch of games. Oh, oh. Heading out to my car to go grab a couple of games to bring inside. I don't really have like a full booth set up at this one. This was partially just to hang out uh, with some friends. But anyways, um, yeah, this is uh, gonna be a great con, so. I'll let you guys know what the update is. I made $100 yesterday just on the setup. And yes, you're not seeing things. I have a PS5. It's a digital edition, but whatever. It's still PS5, worth money. So scheduled to appear here is the Game Chasers, Nintendo, John Riggs, Yoshi Vu, Phoenix Resale, Riff Stapich, uh, Little Rick Fox, Rip Cat, and a few others. <laughs> Arcade Gauntlet. Wow, this is cool. 
Yeah, it's Phoenix Resale and uh, Aaron Stapish. So, uh, hell yeah. Woo. So, I was just playing uh, Blasteroids. And they also have Asteroids. But, uh, this is the arcade portion of the con. And then out behind me over there is a bunch of the, uh, the vendors. A lot of people are here. This was an unplanned con. But... Glad to get some footage for you guys, so see you guys in a second. And if, if you're wondering, this is the, uh, look how big this, this pool area is over here. I've showed this before. Sorry for being redundant, but and then there's a hot tub. But there's actually a bar inside of the rocks you can swim to. That's kind of cool. This is an amazing hotel. Like, if you have a room on the bottom floor here, look at that, you can just jump right out in the pool. And then back there is the, uh, the little bar you can walk in there, or you can swim, so. But uh, I'm gonna go look. They said there's tournaments over here, so I'm gonna go check and see if I can find tournaments. Oh wait, there's a sign. It says tournaments, let's go. So this is the uh, tournament hall. There's a lot of people here doing tournaments. And look, there's our backyard. Look at that. Okay, you guys just missed it. I won a round of Street Fighter. Um, I couldn't get anybody to film for me, but uh, the, I'm in the tournament. The first round was a bye because the other guy didn't show up. And I just won round two against a friend right, of mine. Setup number up, one. Up, up. In here, front we of me, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Emperor and Zach. Emperor and Zach. Okay. I'll see you guys in a second. Ooh. And our second. I'm in one of the next. I'm in the next round, semifinals or whatever it is. I got a bye week, and then I won one. We'll see. So I just came in third place in the more, uh, not Mortal Kombat, it's the Street Fighter tournament. I got really lucky though, guys, because the round that I won, I probably shouldn't have won. And then the round before that, somebody didn't show up, so they got rejected. And it was an auto, like I was finals in the, um, the loser's bracket. But that was cool, I won 20 bucks. And considering I don't have a booth today, I uh, could definitely use that money. So, woo. So I brought some friends with me to the car. Um, promote your guys' channels, I guess. <laughs> Pixel Game Squad and Phoenix Resale. Actually, just Retro Rick. Retro -Rick. Subscribe to Retro Rick, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Woo. Yeah. So they ended up spending about two hundred dollars out of my truck off stuff. So thank you to uh, to Phoenix Resale and them because that definitely helps out with uh, with my day here. Anyway, I will see you guys a little bit later at the con. Woo. Ooh. Oh, look at that. We, 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 we got Star Wars characters. Look at this. That is crazy. It's a bounty hunter. I'm just always looking for some like old school schmucks, like uh, any of the cave. Look at that, it's Dr. Robotnik. Woohoo! Just made another sale. I sold a Pokemon game for $30. I didn't have a whole lot into it. Um, so yeah, I am now almost at 500 for the uh, for the day. Fingers crossed. I got to make another couple sales though. I'm a little behind schedule, but I'm also selling the P the PS5 that I got for 500. So that'll be a G. Uh, so that that's the thousand I really needed to make. But I would like to make an additional $500 because that's what's really going to set us into overdrive. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a second at the con. Woo. Leaving the tournament hall yet again. Um, I lost Smash. But every time there's a Smash tournament, there's like millions and millions of people. It's like early when I came in third place, there was like seven or eight people that probably signed up for the Street Fighter 1. But anyway, I'm going to go back to the convention hall. This has been a nuts con. I mean... Uh, yeah, I'm already over 500 for the day, and I'll see you guys later. Ooh. Day one has came to an end. Um, heading back to the hotel room. It It's pretty late. Uh, I did over f about five today. Hopefully I'll do more about the same tomorrow. Uh, anyway, I'm going to go hit the, hit the hay. I'm kind of tired. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for day two of the con. It is the morning. It is day two of this con. I need to make another 500 today because yesterday was not quite enough but we shall see what's going to happen. Um, today ought to be interesting so I'll see you guys in a second at the con. Wow! There is my uh, 
My system's for sale. Just traded a bunch of games for the uh, Mario Odyssey 3-pack Amiibo. Um, I traded things for one big item, and apparently this is actually going for that. So day two is off to a banger start. Whoa. Heading back into the convention hall, I just filmed some chess matches that you'll see later on a, in another video. But holy crap, that was awesome. I'm in the drive-thru getting some a Whataburger. Uh, we don't have that down by me, but we have it here apparently in the top of Florida. I'll see you guys in a second show you what I got at Whataburger. If you've never eaten at Whataburger, you should check them out. They're really good. And they got really close to McDonald's fries. Whoa. Just made another $70 sale out in the car. Um, I sold Air Combat on the NES and then a long box sealed sport game for $10. I've also made a few, quite a few sales on eBay over the course of this weekend, so I think things are actually going to be pretty good. I would like to make, like I said, another two, three hundred dollars, give or take. But I'll keep you guys updated. It's day two at the con. People are already starting to pack up. I'll see you later. It's the end of another con. Everybody's packing up. Everybody's going home. It is freezing cold. Um, yeah, Fort Walton Beach, Florida. That's where this con was. Really rad weekend. You should check it out if you ever get a chance. I had a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, I'm going to ask a question of the day here in a second, and then I'm going to end this video. So I'll see you guys in a second. Ooh. So question of the day. I know I seem to be going on all these fancy trips, fancy adventures and vacations and one thing after the next, and seemingly not making any money at any, but yet somehow I still managed to pull it off. So my question for you guys is, what is your uh, opinion of all these trips? Do you think I should do more conventions uh, in 2023? You know, because we are approaching the end of the year. What do you think? Should I do more conventions? I want to go to SoCal. I want to go to California. I want to see more of America. What do you think? So comment, like, subscribe below. Let me know what you think about all that. And I will see you guys next time. When, uh, yeah. <laughs> My, the atmosphere speaks for itself. I'll see you guys next time. Woo!